Hey, this is Chris from Texas Toast Guitars, and we're going to spray some clear. So this is the follow-up to our Why We Don't Use Lacquer video. So this is currently the product that we use. It's Omni by PPG MC270 Production Clear. Um, it's a two-part catalyzed product. It's four parts paint, one part hardener. You buy the hardener according to your temperature. In, in your spray booth. This is uh, medium, which is good for like 70 degrees, 70 to 80 degrees. Um, if you were painting in hotter conditions, you could use slower or faster, whatever you need. Yes, okay. yes, slow it is it, how long does it take to dry. Okay. And the hotter it is, the slower you want it. All right. There you go. So I've got. 10 ounces of paint mixed up here. We're going to do a double neck body, a, uh, a regular like telly body, and I think four necks in clear. All of them are going to get, um, well the necks are going to get three coats and the bodies are going to get five coats each. So I think 10 ounces is going to be about right. No, never sand in between clear coats. This whole process from start to finish will take me less than an hour to do. Last year we upgraded our spray gun to the Iwata IPH400, which is, if not the best gun, one of the best guns. It's far and away the best gun I've ever used. It puts paint on way better than anything else I've ever used. Uh, 3M PPS disposable cup system. And the way it works is you've got this disposable liner that goes inside your cup with a disposable lid that's got a filter in it which is pretty cool because the fewer boogers you end up in your in your paint the fewer boogers you have to sand out later and as you know from the last video I'm a huge fan of doubling up on the fill on the the strainers so we're going to strain it with two two strainers and then we're going to run it through this yeah, we don't come out and paint just one body. We, we try and paint several things. Otherwise, I'll use one of the other, other cups if I just have like a little bit of clear to spray. Yeah. Um, the other thing is it's way less lacquer thinner cleanup on this because you're throwing away the disposable part and the cap. You're a so, steward of the environment. It took exactly an hour to put five coats on two bodies and three coats on four necks. And it's about two hours later, maybe maybe two and a half hours later, the paint's starting to cure and everything looks really, really great. This is the double neck uh, from the first video in this series. Uh, it's, it's pretty darn flawless. We'll, we'll sand it and buff it and make it look like two million dollars, it only looks like a million dollars now. Um, here's one of the necks for it. It's a uh, bird's eye roasted maple with uh, kind of a flaming maple back. And yeah. So the next step with these is we will wet sand them probably with uh, 800 or a thousand grit wet dry and we'll go to maybe 1500 just because we have it and it's quick and easy and we'll put it on the buffing wheel and they'll be ready for assembly. So this is Chris with Texas Toast Guitars reminding you that if you want to do this stuff do it and screw it up a bunch like we did and then someday you can make a video where you pretend that you never screwed it up. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Do it yourself. <laughs> what the fuck? Are you, you know how many videos I watch? None. <laughs>